Hello friends, in this video I am just going to fix this issue. Connection failure, unable to connect to the host, please ensure that any firewalls are disabled on the host. If you are trying to connect your OBS for remote control option in stream control, so you might be getting this error, connection failure. So I am going to fix this, give ok. There will be two reasons, ok, you might be installed OBS beta versions, I mean the latest versions. Here you can check on this about sections so 27.1.0 this is beta version you might be installed latest stable versions of OB studio or you might be installed beta so the version can be anything this OBS web socket settings is 5.0 alpha so it is not working properly so you need to install 4.9.1 that was the stable versions so you might be installed OBS web socket 5.0 this is not working properly so what you need to do is go to releases so here just scroll down install this OBS WebSocket 4.9.1 this works perfectly so first I am going to uninstall this existing one control panel uninstall the program see OBS WebSocket version is 5.0 I am going to uninstall it Close OBS Studio as well. OBS web socket was successfully removed from your computer. Okay, it is removed. So now I'm going to close that. I'm going to download and install it. 4.9.1 already I have downloaded. I'm going to install it. So next, install. So finish now open OBS studio it looks like you are running OBS web socket for the first time so OBS web socket is installed so I'm going to close that you can go and check on tools and web socket server settings so this is 4.9 so enable all this enable authentication so I'm going to change the password as well so we don't know what is the default password just enter your new password and enable web socket server and server port by default is 4444 and password I have set 1234 so giving ok now I am going to connect that so cancel it click on new here OBS studio the default port is matching if you have any other port number just enter it here and give ok it should find your internet connections both should be in same wi-fi connections or internet connections so giving ok so i need to enter this password i have entered 1234 submit i can name it obs studio remote controller submit successfully it is connected you can see all the details here if you want to edit or remove you can check this more options okay i'm going to tap this one closing it tapping it so default layout now i can control through my mobile recording a streaming etc so here you can set the scenes as well sources chart because we have not set any sources and scenes that's why it's showing so I'm going to add some sources here and video capture so I need to choose that super cool so PSV is turned on also okay I'm going to simply tap this start recording. You can see this start recording option here also. Start recording. See, it started. You can see the details here. If you want to stop the recording, you can stop it. So you can check that recorded video. Here I have the recorded video. You can remote control your streaming here also from your mobile. I didn't set any path. That's why I mean streaming is not started. You can set the streaming details under settings and you can start your streaming. That's it friends, this is the way you can fix the issue. 
that's it hope this video is very much helpful thank you so much for watching please put the comments and feedbacks on my platforms thank you bye friends and take care